obstacles you would have to worry about are thwomps in Bowser, Bowser Castle and Rainbow Road and uh, falling off courses in, in um, Ghost Valley and Rainbow Road and what else? Oh, and moles and donut planes. Yeah, to this day, I really don't know what was worse on Rainbow Road, the no guardrails or the... Thwomps. Or the thwomps, yeah. yeah. Yeah, the thwomps are worse in Rainbow Road because the thwomps are invincible. You'll spin out with even the slightest touch. Oh, that's why they were glowing earlier. Okay, I'm on yeah. the I'm on the title screen and I'm streaming. I'm I'm also testing my uh, shortcut key recordings for Hypercam. All right, and uh, so so Dine, are you able to record our voices since Paris isn't here tonight? Uh, it it will it will record on both the stream and on the Hypercam input. Great. I'm, yeah, I'm I'm, I'm getting I'm getting mic feedback on both. So I've I've got I'm my game I've got my game audio down low, so the voices should take much higher precedence. I've got a backup going as well, just in case. So, yeah, so how it's going to work is, to make things fair, um, we're, we're all going to start each each course at the same time. So, so, yeah, so that way one doesn't get ahead of the other. Right. Okay, now, now Dine, you've selected Koopa Troopa, Turbo, you've selected Luigi, and I'm going to pick Mario. Yep, I'm on the cart okay. select screen at the moment. All right. Now, okay. So go ahead and uh, select um, Mario Circuit One because that's going to be the first course that we start with. But don't confirm is that okay yet? Because that that's when I say on one, three, two, one. All right. I'm all ready to go when you guys just are. Just give me just give me ten seconds to do a quick uh, test of yeah. traps. Okay. Yep. And I'm gonna break my hypercam uh, recording yep. between each between each each Grand Prix. Okay. Yeah. Well. Yes. Because. Yes, because um, e each each video is gonna because um because part one's gonna be mushroom cup, part two is gonna be flower cup, three will be star cup, and four will be special cup. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. You know, it's a shame we can't do Mario Kart Wii because that way we could do eight cups instead. Yeah, I, I sold my coffee. I really should. Yeah, I don't even have a Wii. So. That. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, like or well, if we were if we were meeting like in person, then we could then we could do Mario Kart Wii. <laughs> oh, oh, easily. <laughs> yeah. Hey, but that, pay for my flat and I'll join you. <laughs> but that probably will never happen because because that would be pretty expensive. For, it would be pretty expensive to get uh, Captain Turbo to fly all the way here. All right, my um, being being thousands, working fine. Being being like thousands of miles away. I don't even know the passport, so. <laughs> okay, these shortcut keys work. <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah, and it, it kind of stinks because Nintendo's uh, removing all the online services for Wii and original DS games in May. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Because um, oh, give me so um, so the the online features will no longer work after that. Right. And so so the people who I play Fortune Street with regularly are all up in arms on that because of course we're probably the only ones who still play it. <laughs> well, um, the only um activity in on the Super Alpha Hero channel that I did not take part in was Fortune Street. Well, that's too bad because it's really fun to play online while you're well, on while you're on Skype with people because that way you can actually negotiate the deals you want to make vocally. Well, at the time I didn't have Fortune Street. Right. Right. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Actually, I'm going to try and get a few games together over the over the next couple months so I can add some more to my playlist on my channel so yeah, there's right. more than just wait, the tutorials. If they're going to do that, are they going to do the same thing with a uh, 3DS too? Uh, no, the 3DS online services will, of course, be going for several more years. They're, they're just phasing out the original DS and Wii for the new stuff. Right. Well, Same actually, well, that probably won't be a big deal because I haven't used uh, used an, uh, the online features on the Wii. Yep, and, uh, and on the DS, uh, the security settings aren't compatible with my current router, so I've been locked out of online for that for a while anyway. Oh, God, that took me so long to set up to be able to play Pokemon online for the DS. Uh <laughs> The, the only game I have where I missed out on anything was Fire Emblem Shadow Dragon, and the online stuff isn't necessary on that one anyway. Well, uh, I have yet to play a Fire Emblem game. Although, oh. although Redemption's Edge once tried to get me to play Fire Emblem Path of Radiance, but I got talked out of it. Uh, by, uh, yeah, um, but if you've seen my uh, Vote for My Next RPG thread on the uh, mag, yeah, yeah, um, Dragon was tell telling me that... Uh, that Fire Emblem is like not a traditional RPG like a uh, Mario RPG and Chrono Trigger. Right. It's more. It's a. It's a strategy RPG with its own twist on battle. Yeah. 
And he said the biggest reason I shouldn't do a Fire Emblem game is because if an ally dies, it can't come back to life. Right, and they they didn't change that until making it an option in the latest one on 3DS. Oh, I thought you were going to say until, like, Radiant Dawn on the Wii. No, Radiant Dawn is harder than Path of Radiance. Even I haven't finished that one yet. <laughs> oh. Of course, Radiant Dawn, of course, it's the direct sequel to Path of Radiance. You're dealing with the aftermath of the First War, and your starting group is just a bunch of rebels who really don't know what they're doing, are horribly <laughs> armed, and the game wants to pound that into your head multiple times. So it's, yes, yeah, so that's why it's more of a strategy game. Yep. And it doesn't help that your main character for that chapter is the weakest thing in, in existence. Yeah. yeah, I'm so glad I actually did not erase my uh, time trial records. I could see see like my best five times that I did. <laughs> for each course, like the fa like my fast time with uh, Luigi is a uh, one minute eleven point zero nine seconds in Mario <laughs> Circuit One. Yeah, that's an easy course. Let's see if we can beat that. Yeah, yeah, and just so you know, like I think this is the only Mario Kart game that has five laps per course. It, everyone's after that had three. Mm -hmm. Of course, the course has got a, a lot longer, just starting at 64 alone. And this one, <laughs> look, how, look how puny that map is on the bottom screen there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, like I said, the reason we're not doing the Grand Prix mode is, is because of its uh, qualifying rules. Right. Yes, because this and Mario Kart 64 were the only two in history... Uh, of what I know of, that if you place fifth or lower, you'd have to have to do it over. Yeah, I don't oh, remember what the Game Boy Advance one does. I know Mario Kart Wii doesn't do that. What about Double Dash? I don't think Double Dash does. Yes, uh, uh, so that's super good. And but even worse about Super Mario Kart Grand Prix is you only get a limited number of do-overs. Mm -hmm. Is it free all five? I think it's about four max. Oh. Unless you finish like in one place three three times, then you'd get an extra do over. So so that so that's that's the, the <laughs> that's the big problem with us doing Mario Kart Grand Prix is like the limit on do overs and the qualifying rules. <clears throat> in Mario Kart 64, there's no limit on do overs. But but by doing time trial, we will not have to worry about do overs. I remember the time I 100%ed Mario Kart 64. I found Flower Cup to be harder than the Special Cup. Uh, I the only in instance I find Flower Cup to be hard is um, Toad's Turnpike in Mirror Mode and Choco Mountain in in in, in harder levels. Of course, both of those are Flower Cup. That's why. <laughs> and hey, Mike Maverick, <laughs> I, I got people tuning into my stream now, so I'll probably greet them. All right. Well, are are you queued up to the uh, to the first course? Yep. Yep. All right, then we can start any time now. All right, just let me know when you guys are recording, and then we'll, I'll go ahead and tell us to do the clap. Yep, I've been recording for seven minutes, so... <laughs> All right. I'll, 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 I'll cut that out before I send the video. All right. Turbo, you recording it? Yep, Co recording now. All right. Come on. All right, let's do the clap on three. One, two, three. Alright. Hello everybody, this is Gold Glee Gamer One and we're back with a brand new race. Um, this time we're doing a Super Mario Kart, which is another unofficial race, and it's gonna be unusual compared to our usual races. Because we're doing every single course in time trial mode, and every one of us is selecting a different character to use. So, um, you all should be queued up to Mario Circuit One. Yep. Ready to go. All right, then uh, we'll start the first course on one, three, two, one. I haven't played this in so long. All I did for practice earlier was try and get the timing for the boost start, and I missed on, on the first go. Oh, yeah, all oh, that oh, that, uh, that jump start at the yeah. beginning, I, I could never perfect that. Yeah, that one has a lot of trickier timing than before. Yeah, but it's easier to do in Mario Kart 64, though. Def definitely started getting easier on the Wii version. On that and 7, I can get it every time. Oh, that was a... Hit the pipe. Yeah, this is going to be easy, because um, now I'll know which which OST tracks to put in at certain points, because I'm... 
It won't be randomized because we're all doing the same course at the same time, so... Yep, and if you have to be... use my audio, you'll have the game game music in the background. Oh my goodness, uh, well, I, I forgot how well, loose the handling is. Well, the OST can be easily found on YouTube, so I, I could use that if I have to. Mm -hmm. And I have to give a shout-out or congratulations to one of my viewers in the stream, Mike Maverick. He just got a new job, so congratulations on that. <laughs> Please continue to watch the Super LP vi Heroes videos. <laughs> Very weird to be playing this with an Xbox 360 control. I don't think it would be that uh, bad. Okay, I finished in uh, one eleven fifty two. Oh, I'm way behind. One fifteen. Oh, I got third. <laughs> one 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 nineteen thirteen. Okay, everybody, get queued up to a Donut Plains one. Best lap was the third there. Okay. All right, you guys all set for the next course? I um, am now. All right, on one, three. Two, one. If I can get a boost start, that'll come in handy. Nope. Zero out of two. Oh. Yeah, I tried to put the same thing. Oh, don't go off the course there, Koopa Troopa. It's weird, I still feel like everyone's behind me and I'm waiting for a shell or something. <laughs> What am I on? Am I driving on ice? That's what it feels like. I can't keep straight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> well, are you having a hard time with those turns? I'm not having a hard time with the turns. I'm just having a hard time with how loose the handling is compared to the later games. Uh, and, and, at, at the same time, I just go in much more tightly and end up right in the grass. Well, when I come out of a drift, I just seem to seem to keep sliding. <laughs> there we go. That pulse. Just gotta get adjusted to it a little more. That last bend keeps spinning me out, Neil. Lap four. Oh, that was a bad move. That killed that lap time. Oh, did you get hit by a mole? No, there there aren't any moles in this one. Oh. I don't, oh yeah, I, they they don't start showing uh, up until Donut Plains too. In, that, I think. in the flower cup. Uh. Oh yeah, if you watch my LP of this game, you know one mole screwed me out of a perfect score. Oh. <laughs> oh okay, I beat it in a one thirty-eight twenty-seven. I'm about to cross the finish line. One forty-four oh nine. <laughs> All right, guys, let's uh, get ready to do Ghost Valley one. Okay. I'm in. All right. All right. All right, you got all right. You guys all set? Yep. Yep. All right. On one. Three, two, one. All right. Here's where things might start getting a bit tricky. <laughs> all right. Got the boost. Come on. Careful, this, is, this is a course where you could actually fall off the tracks. Mm. Still pretty tame compared to Rainbow Road, though. Oh, definitely. It, yeah, it is. Which we'll be getting to a little bit later. I, I'm going to call it right now. All of us are going to fall off at least twice on Rainbow Road. Well, that's a good assumption. That that could happen. Uh, yeah, is that right? <laughs> yeah, I'm doing better not jumping when turning. I guess that's just the way it was in this one. Yeah, I've been taking it quite slow. Especially at the, at, after that first corner, you have that slick spot, you have to hit, on, hit straight on, otherwise you could lose control. I'm guessing all of us have quite a bit of experience with this game then, don't we, from my childhoods and whatnot? Oh yes. This is one my brothers and I would play all the time because it let us beat up on each other without getting in trouble. <laughs> no, that was my middle brother that was the one who ended all up right, beating it for beat us. beat it in 117.28. 119.28. Oh, you just beat me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get ready to do Bowser Castle 1. Okay. Yeah, I think uh, the, the key is to not play this one like, is, like, like it's the later games. 
Alright. Okay, you guys queued up to Bowser Castle 1? Yep. Yep. Alright, on one. Three, two, one. Okay, I got the boost again, so I, I think I have a good uh, idea on yeah. when to press the button. Uh, yeah, it's a shame they don't have the zippers in time trial. Oh, you're right. I just just realized that. I mean, don't do that. Uh... Yeah, you know, in Diddy Kong Racing, you could actually use zippers to your advantage. Oh, uh, Diddy Kong Racing. I still have, have nightmares about that game. Because, you know, because in Diddy Kong Racing, if you let go of the accelerator before you land on a zipper, you'll get more speed. Mm-hmm. Never got a chance to play that one. Uh, it's a fun game, but the AI will piss you off so much it just stops becoming fun, especially well, the f especially the final yeah, boss. Actually, the, yeah, well, actually, the the two races in that game I have trouble with are the second octopus race and the first whiz pig race. Yep, those ones I yeah. hated so much. Yeah, the second whiz pig race is no problem. Isn't uh, Mario sixty four supposed to have really bad uh, rubber band AI? Oh, it does. Yeah, Mario, Mario Kart 64 is the worst. Because even if you took the the glitch shortcuts in Wario Stadium and Rainbow Road, the AI would still catch up. That's, that's how bad they were. Oh, that swamp actually kind of gave me a boost. I don't know how it happened, but I bumped the backside of him while turning and he sent me forward. I'm calling hacks right now. <laughs> no, just poor physics. Final lap. Know, <laughs> oh, got a random that time. And final stretch. Can I be two right. minutes? Beat it in 15185. 152. 156. 28. <laughs> Alright, let's get ready to do Mario Circuit 2. Of course, I'm using a lightweight, so I have a lower top speed. <laughs> Alright, you guys at Mario Circuit 2? I am yep. now. Alright, on one. Three, two, one. Oh well, I always use the Koopa Troopa. Now this is a level you don't want the boost on, because you got that at corner right at the beginning. You'll just go right oh. into the wall if you boost. And I just go I right just into the pipe. Into pipe. <laughs> Same here. <laughs> <laughs> I just managed to click that and didn't actually hit it. Yep, just want to do the drift turns on the sharper corners there. Oh, I'll click that same bleeding pipe again. I oh, my game just froze for a second then. Oh. Oh, still good? I love racing this course on Mario Kart 7 just because of all the tricks you can do with how simple the layout is, but you can still just fly around. I'm guessing with the uh, improved physics, it makes it a lot more fun as well. Yep. Of course, they, they added in a glider segment on the jump. So you hit the glider, fly inside the wall, and you can bounce off another jump and just cut, cut that last corner completely. Final lap. Oh, three times I've uh, ran into that pipe. I don't think I'm ahead of you. <laughs> yeah, I, my uh, game froze for a second. It spun me out. So, all right, beat it in one thirty-four oh three. One thirty-seven ninety-seven. One thirty-nine fifty-eight. Now there, right. were, there was one incident on this game where an AI player and I got the exact same time, down to the hundredth of a second. But it gave me the win. Alright, well, we'll see you next time for Flower Cup. Later, folks. Bye. Bye. Okay, stopping Hypercam now. Hey, that that went pretty good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, um, so, Turbo, you said the game froze on you at one point? Uh, barely for a second, but it just, it, it caused me to uh, spin out slightly into a wall. <laughs> okay, well... Alright, well, I'm going to have to look at that to, to, 
to see if I should give give you a second advantage or not. No, I have still <laughs> enough coal, which anyway, forget it. You still really matter. All right. Okay, so um, all right, so um, so next video is gonna be flower cup. Okay. Starting recording okay. now. Hey, right, Turbo, oh. you recording? I'm now. Uh, one second. Uh, should be recording. Let me just check. Sorry, I've got to close emulator to see if it's recording. I just have to remember these shortcut keys. There's a separate one for stopping. <laughs> Which does make sense. And I'm recording. Alright, let's do the clap on three. One, two, three. That sounded more like a punch. <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Race Super Mario Kart. And this part, we are going to do Flower Cup. So everybody should be queued up at Chaco Island 1. Mm, Chaco. Yep. <laughs> All right, go. then. Let's go on one. Three, two, one. Oh, I was a little behind, but oh well. <laughs> Do the moles still appear even in time trial mode? Um, the moles? Yeah, the uh, moles and the piranha plants, plants and those and the stupid annoying ice and vanilla dome. Oh, I forgot. You I mean vanilla that. lake? Yeah. I'm, th I'm thinking of Mario World. Uh, yeah, of course. That's that's an easy mistake to make. Of course, this game was released like two years after Super Mario World was. Yep. No, it, it did use the worlds in Super Mario World as is, as the basis for most of the courses. Yeah. The Chuck Island and all that stuff. Yep. No, not doing too bad. It's mostly stayed on the course this time. Haven't hit any piranha plants. Of course, I have to do. up and going. Oh, get back on the course! <laughs> I don't know how I slid off on that one. And I beat it in 112.25. Sweet Jesus. 115.91. Uh, 117.40. Alright, let's head over to Ghost Valley 2. Now this right. is the one where it can start to get tricky. All right, you guys uh, ready? Ready. Yep. All right, on one, three, two, one. Yeah, looking at these maps, there's almost no point in getting the boost at the beginning because you have a corner right there. Oh, I was probably too soon on that one. I forgot I'd actually get the boost. Uh, you do it between the first and second light on the countdown. Right. As for exactly when, I'd say right as the volume of the first beep reaches its peak. Unfortunately, I've got sound turned off, so I can't hear it. I don't really remember the, the tiers on this one. Is Peach a medium weight? Or lightweight on this one? Um... Princess and Yoshi have fast acceleration. Okay. They're on the light white scale then. Along, along with Koopa Troopa and Toad. Yeah. It seems that Mario and Luigi are the only mid-weights. Yeah. For, for the first Mario and Luigi are standard performance. And uh, Bowser and DK Jr. have high top speed. Just horrible, horrible acceleration. <laughs> yes. And not exactly perfect for tri time trials. That's okay. None of us are. No, I just mean uh, Bowser. Beat it in, uh, in 11806. We got the exact uh, one, same time! 120 for me. <laughs> it's a, we, we tied? We tied! <laughs> <laughs> that is going to be interesting. Somebody timestamp that in the comments. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, was just, right. I, I was just about to say, I beat it at 11806 when you spoke up first, Gold. <laughs> and, and I, I stayed quiet just to hear your time. <laughs> My jaw dropped. <laughs> All right, let's uh, head over to Donut Plains too. 
There, there's your highlight of the whole race there, guys. <laughs> Alright, guys, uh, you guys ready to do Donut Plains 2? Yep. Yep. Alright, oh. on one. Three, two, one. Oh, uh, we get to encounter the Monty Moles. They're gonna hump our faces. Yep. You're doing a lot better in this cup so far, Dan. Uh, yeah. a, li a little bit. Of course, I'm finally getting used to the game again. Oh, got a money mole on the first lap. My dog's staring at me from my door. <laughs> Mine's fast asleep next to me. Wow, I avoided all the moles, but I spun out. <laughs> That's probably the worst worst situation you could get into. With the moles, you can just shake them off right away and not lose a lot of speed. Is yeah, that what I they do then? Slow you down? Yep. Which makes sense, they do add a little extra weight on you. Oh, I keep misjudging that turn right bad. I should wonder what's worse, hitting the grass or hitting a mole? Well, I've hit grass practically every lap this so. Yeah, me too. Oh, that was close. Technically, I ran over the mole, but with the way the game works, if it had jumped out, it still would have stuck to me. I don't dare go at top speed here, because I'm frightened of going into the grass, and I'm frightened of hitting one of the moles. Yeah, there's only one I'm really dreading other than Rainbow Road, and it's Vanilla Lake 2. Oh, yeah, that, that one's a killer. Especially That's with all those ice blocks, they can slow you down. Not what I'd say was that the one with the ice. Not not only slow you down, but bump you into the water. All right, beat it in one fifty six thirty eight. Man, I'm way behind you on this one. I'm just rounding the uh, last beat quarter. Beat in two oh one. Two oh two sixty two. All yeah, right. That time. Yep. All right, let's head over to Bowser Castle two. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Ready to go. All right, same here. All right, then on one, three, two, one. Okay. Still can't get that boost. I think I got the timing down, but can't haven't quite perfected it. Oh, I hate that turn. Yeah, one thing I learned through playing Mario Kart over the years, never use the brake, just let up on the gas. Actually, in Mario Kart 64, there is one spot where you want to use the brakes. W would that be Banshee Boardwalk 150cc? <laughs> no, that would be Calamari Desert. Oh, yeah, with, with the train. Yes. Well, actually, I've been using brakes so far uh, all this race, so I'm going to stop using it. I'm just hitting the walls left and right here. On the plus mm -hmm. side, I haven't hit any thwomps, but it's only the second lap. Oh, um, Mike, Mike Maverick got a screen cap of the, of the Ghost Valley 2 <laughs> time, so he's uploading it to Image Shack. Uh, what, what we meant by timestamp is when this goes up on YouTube, we're going to ask one of the commenters to to note the time of the video where that happens. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, another thing. That, that moment should definitely be on the Tropes page. Oh, of course. <laughs> Just have to see. Oh, I fell into the lava. Crap. Just have to figure out which one that falls under. Def definitely a moment of funny. Because the, the odds of that are slim to nil. It's only the second time it's happened in my life after... Hundreds and hundreds of hours of Mario Kart all over the board. <laughs> oh, don't get swamped. That was close. <laughs> Too close. I'm doing, doing absolutely terribly this... Uh, oh, I fell in again. I think I'm probably going to come last on this one.
Now, this course really has that cruel design because you go through that first jump, and then you think you can turn and take a shortcut, but it's just a dead end. All right, 211.48. Oh. I'm barely halfway through last lap. <laughs> I'm rounding last corner. I'm probably going to get 220 or so. Oh, not uh, two. Yep, 219.37. All right. Well, you know when I've got to the end. <laughs> All right. Okay, so so while uh, he's doing that. Okay, then uh, everyone get set for Mario Circuit 3. Okay, one sec. Oh, yeah. Right, right there. L looking right. at it from the side, this this course reminds me of an Earthbound boss. Uh, all right, hey guys, on one, three, two, one. The dis the department's for spook. That's what it is. You, you got the mouth on the left side, the eyes with eyes on the socks on the on the right side. The department store spook. Yep. Oh, crap. That hairpin turn in the middle? Yeah. Yeah, that's a hard turn to make. So one of the tricks to these courses is the red and white lines do not slow you down. So long as you can hug those, you can hit the turns a little better. Now, I was thinking of some other race ideas that if I should win anything in the future on what to play, and I realized something really cool that we could do that I don't know if anyone else has done, and, of course, this will probably give them ideas, but uh, Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland has a Meta Knight mode that you get for... Oh, Meta Nightmare Ultra? Yep. Oh, wait, that was in Superstar DS, wasn't it? Uh, that... It was first in Nightmare in Dreamland. You get it by getting 100% of the game and then clearing extra mode. And I didn't do that in my LP because I didn't know about it. But I, th I thought, you know, that would be a really cool way to race the game. Because I've seen plenty of Kirby ad Kirby's Adventure races out there. Oh, we have yet to do one. Yeah, but I'm hoping that we somehow we'll race all six games of the Dream Collection. Well, five of them are easily doable. 64 would probably be trickier, but unless... Well... Not going for all the shards. All right, I did it in 154.83. Uh, 157. 159.68. All right. Okay, join us next time for Star Cup. Later, folks. Bye. See ya. Yeah, stopping recording now. Going to get in position for Star Cup. Yep. So, yeah. yep. So we should be queued up for Cuba Beach One. Yep. Just check and make sure it recorded fine. Now this one I may have the advantage on being lightweight, but we'll see. <laughs> uh, yeah, you might. Yep, everything's fine. Alrighty. Okay, I'm starting next recording now. Alright. Turbo, let me know when you're recording. Recording now. Alright, let's do the clap on three. One. Two, three. All right. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Race Super Mario Kart. And uh, this part, we're going to do Star Cup. So everybody should be queued up at Koopa Beach 1. Ready yeah. to go. All right, then. On one, three, two, one. Yet another one that starts off with a sharp turn. And I messed up the boost. Oh, I forgot about the cheap cheeps. They just make you spin out though, right? Yeah, they do. Actually, I think this is the shortest course. It's one of them. But I think the oh, shortest yeah. one would probably be Vanilla Lake 1. True, we have to get to that one. Probably just seems longer because the water slows you down, I suppose. Yeah, even with that, it, 
just right in the corner and think, am I done with the lap already? We can probably get through Mario Circuit 1 faster. Final lap. Mm. Oh, this one's going to be close. Yep. Stay out of that water, Koopa Troopa. Home stretch and 118 58. Ah! 118 even. 117. No, yeah, that's probably the closest Whoa. one we had. Wait, you. <laughs> wow, Turbo, you, you got to win. Woohoo! <laughs> all right, let's uh, do a Choco Island 2. We were all within one second of each other on that one. Yeah, I know. All right, you guys here are queued up for Choco Island 2? I am now. All right, on one, three, two, one. If I had not messed up on the boost, I probably would have gotten that one. <laughs> I didn't even get the boost, and I actually screwed up once. I remember this one giving me a lot of trouble when I was younger. Oh, yeah. That, that oh, I've already screwed up. Turn at the very top is... Oh, man. Those turns at the top of the map, they... They are the worst. Second half isn't nearly as bad. Oh, I thought I hit that piranha plant. I, I love all the little bumps on these courses. It just looks like the cart has hot foot. Do the um, hops actually slow you down at all, or does it not affect your speed at all? in any way. I'm not 100% sure. I think they do. But I could be wrong. Mm. Okay, that time I hit the piranha plant. <laughs> oh, barely clipped him again. Get back on the road. In through the lake of chocolate. Augustus Gloop is I drowning in there somewhere. I think me and you will bang next to each other dying. 12881. 13051. Alright, that was pretty good. Final lap right. is the best. Okay, let's head over to Vanilla Lake 1. Okay. Oh, that bottleneck at the end. I remember that. All right, you guys uh, all set for the next course? All set. Yep. All right, on one. Three, two, one. Does it actually have um, ice physics here? We're about to find out. No, thankfully it doesn't. Ah. Oh. Uh, it's okay, I hit one too. I've hit about three. <laughs> I hit several. I don't remember if they respawn. We'll f we're about to find out. Nah, I don't think they do. You're right, they don't. But I'm still hitting them anyway. <laughs> well, think of it this way. They won't be as much trouble for you in later laps. True. So long as I maintain the same route every time. <laughs> All those ass blocks, I decide to run into the pipe. Cut that last corner. Oh, snap. Okay, can I get to the final lap without hitting an ice block? I'm quite behind you, or two, then, if you have a final lap. Hey, I made it! 110.56. What, 11.57? Oh. And I'm not there yet. <laughs> One sixteen. All right, let's do a uh, Bowser Castle three next. Okay. All right, you guys all set? All set. All set. All right, on one, three, 
two, one. Try and remember the best way to take this one. Just with those three splits. Yeah, I'm still can't get that boost. Well, you have that bottleneck at the top that messed mine up. Bounce, bounce, bounce off the walls. Just bounce off the walls. <laughs> Okay, center lane has no wumps. Ah. Oh crap, missed that, that turn. Hit that stupid corner. I think that... Daniel may have done the same thing there. Then you have all four of those thwomps blocking your path at the, at the midway point. I don't remember if they stopped the AI players. I... No, I don't remember either. That would totally suck if the AI went through them. Of course, for Mario and Luigi, they just pop a star man and go right through. I misjudged that turn again. Move out my way. Ah. I slowed down too much and hit the wall anyway. Go me. <laughs> oh, I did it again. All right, final lap. Yep. Sitting on 145 at the moment. Oh, and now I'm on my final lap. Oh, I might win this one. That's yeah, all I can, can. That's all I can ask for is one first place. <laughs> I've been just, saying that since I joined this place, pal. <laughs> you just might get it. Oh, that. Oh, stay light. Me. Yep, two hundred four <laughs> seventy six. Yeah, I think I'm going to come last this one as well. Two thirteen fifty one. Whoa. <laughs> one say. 217 that from uh, from crushed me right at end that's gonna be that's gonna be an interesting one to watch oh okay. okay let's uh do mario circuit four okay. i actually find this one easier than circuit three all right you guys uh, you guys all set yep all set all right on one three two one Yep, I knew I was too soon on that one. Oh, right off the course. Into the pipe. Off the course again. You know what, Dine, since you actually uh, beat me in that last course by a few seconds, you know, that actually, you never know, that might be enough to uh, win you the cup. You don't know. Ah, uh, we'll, we'll find out, because... The, the cup's not over yet. Right. It's still got special cup yet. Yeah, so there's like, yeah, there's the winners of each cup individually, and then it's the winner overall. Most of which I think you've gotten it. I, I think I've had a few where I was about five or six seconds behind you, Gold, so. And of course, I've taken more thirds than anyone. I think I've got most thirds. Yeah, uh, we'll, we'll find out once we count them up at the end. Yep. Yeah. So, uh, I think um, there's only been two that I uh, did not come in first in. Yeah, because both Dan and my, uh, me's only got one win so far. <laughs> oh, I could have thrown through those pipes. Only lap four? Dang. It's a long course, Dine. Even the other ones that are similarly long didn't feel like this long. <laughs> we'll probably be done within two minutes. I think it's because it's time trial and mod as well. There's not as much going on. One thing I noticed yeah. is the oil slicks aren't there. It's yeah. in interesting that they would keep the prana plants and mining moles, but not the oil slicks. Okay, final lap. Pipe, 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 pipe!
Uh, done. Two, two twelve. Tw two twelve forty eight. Uh, two, two four twelve oh one. Just Whoa. Two fourteen eighty seven. Wow. Two fourteen eighty seven. You said. Yep. Wow. So Dying beat me in that course by forty seven one hundredths of a second. Actually, I beat you. No, no. Yeah, Dying. Yeah, you did beat me by forty seven one hundredths of a second. What? What were your no, times again? <laughs> He got 2.12.01, and I got 2.12.48. Yeah, so you guys beat me. I, I got last on that one, 2.14.87. All right, join us next time for Special Cup. Bye, Later, guys. folks. Bye. Okay, stopping recording now. Yep, same here. Okay, Special Cup could get very interesting. Got to put in the code for it. I've already got it in. All right. I'm just checking set. the code in again. Yeah, that's done fine. I honestly can tell you which one of these I hate the most. Rainbow Road, right? No, I love Rainbow Road. Especially playing it on 7. Uh, Do you guys actually... Uh, sorry, Kyle. Okay. What, okay, then, what, okay then, then which one do you hate the most, then? Probably Vanilla Lake 2. We'll, we'll, we'll see which one makes me the angriest. <laughs> well, it, it'll get hard on the first lap. But, oh. uh, yeah. I'm just going to ask, do you guys actually have a favorite course at all in this game? Um, I haven't thought of that. And on this one, it's kind of hard because there, there's really nothing that sets them apart other than the obstacles. And it, it wasn't until six, it wasn't until '64 when they really started to seem unique. Mm, fair enough. This is going to be a pretty short um, recording session. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, we'll be done before or we're, we've been going for an hour. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, well, well, you know, if we had, well, if we um, if we had everybody, we we could have could have done an official race, but, but uh, no, we we but no, he cannot do that because we don't have everybody here. Oh well. Yeah, well, but we will still keep in mind uh, the continuation uh, of uh, Super Metroid. <laughs> yeah, I'm hoping uh, Drock will let let me know what day she is available for. Um, yeah, as I said, I'm glad we're not doing this next week because um. So that's daylight savings time. So, mm. yeah. So, yes. So, so it's it's. Uh, Diane, you're aware that that's the night we turn our clocks ahead an hour. Yep. Yep. All right. Okay, guys. We all set to start special cup. Yep. Recording yep. now. Recording turbo. Same. Yep. Doing it now. All right. Let's do the clap on three. One, two, three. Hello everybody and welcome back and here's what's definitely going to be the conclusion of the Super Mario Kart race. So if uh, everybody's queued up for Donut Plains 3, we will go on yeah. one. Three, two, one. This is going to take longer than the other three cups combined, viewers. Probably. Yeah, because there are some courses that could prove to be brutal. Oh, I was way oh, too late on the boost. boost again. I would just like to be able to pull off the boost at least once here. I've never done the boost. Never. Never. And I just got hit by a mole. Oh, oh on, I some, somehow got around that one. Just got to stay out of the water. That's the biggest obstacle in this one. Oh, you know how to do the short jump? They can uh, allow you to jump the gap on the second bridge. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm two for two on jumping that sucker. Yeah, this one's not so bad without the AI. It's just the shop turns as usual. And the money walls. You can get rid of them pretty quick though. Yep. And that last. And my dog is snoo Sorry, carry on. <laughs> No, I was just saying that la that last turn, you can easily cut the corner there. Whoa, 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 stay out of the water. I don't know if he's picking up, but my dog is snoring really loudly. <laughs> yeah, my first dog was a snorer. You can hear her all the way from across the house. Jesus Christ. My, my current dog is probably the most ticklish dog I've ever met. You just pat his belly, he'll shake his leg. <laughs> 
What kind of dog do you have? Yeah, he's a Chow Australian Shepherd mix. Oh, I hit the mole and took my finger off the accelerator. That last corner, 148.33. 149. And 157.51. Whoa! Wow. <laughs> what happened, Gold? I don't know. I had um, I had some uh, some uh, sharp turn troubles. <laughs> Expecting uh, you to do better than any of us. All right, Eliza. You guys, are you ready to start Koopa Beach two? Yep. Yep. All right. On one. Oh, I three, I, I started two, early. Sorry. One. What did you say? Started early. Yeah, my my finger slipped. I accidentally confirmed ahead of time, but. Since, since we're basing it on the times themselves. Yeah, that's probably won't be too much of an issue. Yeah, but, yeah. But, but it's not about who gets there first, it's it's about, about time. Yep. Oh, I've forgotten how this one's laid out. Jesus. Oh! I was doing so well to avoid the deep water oh. on the last course and hit it on this one. Yeah, same. I mean, I've just done <laughs> Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do very well this course. First you, got, you got the narrow neck with the deep water and then the cheap cheap right in the middle yeah. there. That same one I keep almost running into every time. I noticed you called me the quiet one on the TV tropes page, by the way, Dying. Uh, j just based on those two races, I, I, I had to come up with material, otherwise it would have taken the page down. Well, oh uh, yeah, it's uh, I notice it's still in its beginning stages. Yep. Uh, you haven't watched a lot of our earlier races yet. Not yet. I, I haven't had time. Of course, over the past week, I was really trying to finish Okami HD before the end of the month. All right. So I was mostly listening to him in the background. One twenty fifty nine, by the way. One nineteen sixteen. Oh dang! One nineteen oh one. Oh! <laughs> Turbo, you beat me by fifteen one hundredths of a second. <laughs> well, so far I'm not getting getting first in this cup yet, which is very surprising. Yeah. All right, so uh, let's uh, get set for uh, Ghost Valley Three. Oh, we got okay. the holes eaten out of the middle of the board on this one. All right, you guys ready? Yep. Yep. All right, on one, three, two, one. <clears throat> Still can't get that boost. Got it at that time, but we'll see how much good it does. Oh, I remember this one. I, I got muscle memory working on this one. Even though it's 20 years old. I don't remember playing this one at all. I don't actually think I ever did actually play this one. That's what I'm counting on for Rainbow Road is muscle memory. The problem is, I always sucked at the Super NES version, so I have to channel my Mario Kart 7 Super NES Rainbow Road skills into that one. Uh, first time I played Rainbow Road was about an hour ago when I was practicing. <laughs> so I'm still pre very new to that level. Yeah, I'm going to say the thwomps are the worst part of that one. Indeed. Uh, is that even worse like than constantly falling? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm surprised the the AI characters hardly ever fall off the track in that one. Of course, they're they're on a set course. The only way to knock them off is to bump them off. I'm amazed no one's actually fell off in any uh, any of the ghost levels yet. No, it's yep. It, nobody's fallen off yet. It's not that bad to fall off on most of them. This one has that one stretch, but since you're coming in wide, it's easy to. Hit it on the left edge. Although I did fall into lava a few times, so that might count. I did. I don't remember. Do you automatically get fished out right away, or does, is it treated like deep water? Uh, you get fished out. Okay. Yeah, that, I'd count that. And one forty-seven seventy-one. One forty-nine fifty-nine. One fifty-seven to. Okay, well, this is getting as close as it gets. Okay, we all set for a Vanilla Lake 2? Yep, yep, which I don't expect to be as close at all. <laughs> all right. Yeah, I'm probably going to be lost on this one. On one. 
Three, two, one. Dare I, I take that shortcut? I screwed up badly on the last ice level. I can't see this one being much better. Oh, oh bad start. I got that ice in the middle there. Oh, and I fell into the water. You have those little islands there. More ice at the end. And that's just the first lap. I didn't give myself enough time to get used to ice, ice physics in this game. I should have probably done that. Oh, crap, 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 crap! Oh, I hit all five of that row! That probably cost me the race right there. Uh, don't be so sure, Dine. I was doing well on dodging the ice until the third lap, so we'll see. I can't really hold these bleeding well, blocks. Well, I'm on the fourth lap right now. Yeah, same here. Okay, final lap. Ooh, Dine, you're ahead. As so long as I can stay that as well. As so long as I can stay that way is the key. If I don't hit those ice blocks again! <laughs> Crap! Oh, I fell into water and pretty far in as well. Okay, 125.30. 125.85. Oh, that was close. <laughs> yep, still going here. Okay, now, this is going to be very interesting to see how, how Rainbow Road ends up. With lots of okay. screaming. Alright. Alright guys, everybody set for Rainbow Road? My nerves yep. are steeled. Alright, on one. I get pumped up for this one. Three, two, one. Come on, let me boost this. Oh, I was too, too late on that one, actually. Oh, Christ. So what did you say earlier? Uh, Dying two falls uh, for each of us. Yep. First lap, I don't expect anyone to fall. Just once those swamps start getting activated, we swerve to get around them. Did they activate after the first lap or something? Yep. Yes. Uh. That's how they operate on every course where it has them. I didn't realize that. Okay, first lap flawless. Yep, same, yep, same for me. Now this is probably going to be a dumb oh, question. Oh man, I fell. Dumb question to ask it this late in the game, but which is the break button on this version? Uh, I don't think it really matters. I've just been using break button most of the game. Oh, I fell into. I went into the front swamp. Jesus, didn't knock me off, thankfully. Yeah, that's the worst that can happen. This seems pretty tame, though, compared to uh, a lot of the newer Rainbow Roads, though. Well, if I remember correctly, I think the one I had the most oh, trouble okay. with was uh, the one on the Game Boy Advance version. And I honestly don't remember much about that one at all. It was probably the worst in the series, if you ask me. I've never played it, but the one on the Wii looks pretty difficult. Uh, mostly because of the AI cheats. Yeah, you have 12 racers, and they're all against you. Oh, third time I've gone into a uh, thwomp. Keep mispronouncing it. <laughs> oh, and I fell off. Crap. And I'm on the final lap. So am I. Yes, same here. Oh, I fell off again. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I fell off a few times, actually. Only prediction for two was has been right. <laughs> What? I was Did on the. No, I fell off at the very end. I was almost flawless. Two twelve sixty six. Two nineteen point eight. Two eighteen eight seven. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think I won that cup. <laughs> All right. Well, we're gonna find out <laughs> after I edit this video. All right. Well. Well, guys, I think it's going to be no surprise who may win the first three cups, but uh, special cup, I cannot not declare who's going to be the winner until until I get to editing the video. All right, but um, 
All right, guys. Um, thanks for watching this race. Um, um, hopefully soon we'll be we'll we'll uh, be we'll be getting the Super Metroid race up and running. So be on the lookout for that. Um, make sure you check out everyone's channels. Show them some love, and uh, we'll be back for the next race later, folks. You guys take care. See you next time. All right. Whoo, that was fun. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty fun actually. All right, so now before you guys go, so um.